I'm doing a Shark Valley Tram Tour at Everglades National Park today. This is a visitor center and parking. Looks like parking fills up pretty quick because they rent bicycles here too. There's the tram over there. And you definitely want to get your tickets in advance. Seems like they're sold out for every time. I'm doing the 10 o'clock tour and uh, bicycle rentals right here. And this is the little waiting area once you get your tickets inside. It's a beautiful day today. It's mid January and it's probably 50 degrees right now. I've got a uh, coat on. <laughs> The Everglades is a very slow moving river of grass. So, name had already been interrupted by some wildlife on the right side of the tram, my left. The first of what is hopefully many alligators. This one looks like it's resting gently in the sun. This is a mother alligator. You may be fortunate enough to see some of her babies. This is old, reliable. She's here at a culvert. Culverts are underwater tunnels that move water from one side of the road underneath the road to the other side, rounding things that can be found here. The Everglades is huge, as I mentioned, 1.5 million acres, and it encompasses anywhere between 9 to 13 different habitats. That difference is between that number is uh, basically how uptight of an Everglades botanist you want to be. certainly does not look interested in uh, jumping onto the tram and making a snack for the I'd like you to observe the thick alligators have up to eight sharp teeth. Their teeth are formed to make limestone. So let's talk about how this... Oh, we got a great blue heron. Not pretty good, but great. Alligators are the most popular reptile in the park, but we also have crocodiles. Hopefully, fingers crossed, we'll see a crocodile later. That we're driving on. This road needed to be elevated because, again, there's either flood or drought. This road was elevated. Instead of uh, bringing in imported marble, they used locally sourced and organically grown ingredients. They dug down, got limestone to build this road up. They made an area artificially low, really low, so it fills with water during the wet season and remains wet during the dry season. Called the borrow pit because the limestone has been borrowed, but I really don't think that we're going to be returning the limestone anytime soon. As a result, you might have noticed some different types of plants growing around that borrow pit. Nine inches from the nose to the eyes, probably about nine feet away. 
and now you just got to swim without it. Maybe it's just me. It's been over served a little bit. The other day he did not have a scrolling bow, so it looks like that alligator, again, not being lazy, it just overate a little bit. So if you consider alligators to be lazy, all alligators want to do is hang out in the Florida sun and overeat. Smiling for us. They are the apex predator. But they are a keystone species because the habitat that alligators build helps to support animals that are lower on the food chain, animals that the alligator doesn't eat. When alligators are born, they will stay with their mother for up to two years. That's a strong maternal instinct for a reptile. Many reptiles. Birds and the waiting birds. The birds of prey out here, the aquatic birds of Cormac, they need to eat an awful lot, just like we need to eat every day in order to stay healthy. The alligators, big reptiles, do not need to eat. Uh, but most of the no, fish no, that we're going to see, see both time. here and on our way back, are going to be fish that do not belong here, not native fish species, because canals connect where we are with Greater Miami. So about 80% of the individual fish that are found here are not fish that belong here. Not all of them can be eaten by native species. Yeah. The trail to the observation tower, which is the best view of the Everglades. So the tour guide said. It almost looks like an unreal person that way. Was it? Oh, it's always like it's always So the elevation grade is six inches. It goes from seven feet at the visitor center to six and a half feet here. And this is the Barrow Pit Trail out by the observation tower where they took some of the limestone to make the pathways. Trail's only 0.2 miles. It's kind of cool to just be in here now. The gator that I saw from the observation tower is somewhere around here. It's like we're running out of real estate here. 
There are a lot of Burmese pythons in the Everglades too, but they say you don't really see them very often. And the water is really mostly rainwater. Oh. oh, there's a gator. Oh no, fish. Big fish. A lot of gar. is a bird that likes to eat fish, but it does so from below the surface of the water. Unlike a duck, which has hydrophobic oils, oils that are repelled over the feathers, that bird wants to be mutually buoyant. It wants to be able to Very small brains. They don't really need to do very much other than what it is that they're doing. They can learn bad habits when they're fed by people. But the Everglades has a connotation of being a dangerous place, and maybe it has to do with some other large reptiles that can be found. 92, Hurricane Andrew, Category 5 storm, destroyed the community of Homestead in the southern portion of the park. There was an exotic pet breeding facility. It was believed that that injection of snakes was enough to have a stable breeding population. There is another, again, a male Andrew. In just a few, maybe just a few short days, that male Andrew is going to take on a very beautiful brown scarf. Hey, Judge. She got an iron on it? I can't see it. I don't have my, I got my sunglasses. I don't have my regular glasses. She also Pretty big one. I guess alligators eat turtles. Be a lot of shell to get through. So I'm just walking the, the Shark Valley Road. What gators, alligators do? Hang out and do nothing. What does this gator have something in his nose? Wait, that's not a red thing. Like a South Florida one. Mira el gusano que está encima de la nariz. I'm going to walk the Bobcat Boardwalk Trail here at Shark Valley. Goes from, goes across the glades from one side to the other. These are all pond apple trees, I believe. And I guess the apples are edible. There's no fruit on them right now. Darn. Lots of planes. 
Valley. Tiene los ojos cerrados. Tiene los ojos cerrados. Sí, porque si fueran para acá, ahorita, ahorita, ahorita movió. Si fuera real, los hubieran movido ya 15 pies. 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 15 Right here. Oh, no, pero viendo para acá. Eh, todo, todo. Ay. Voy. Al trencito, Mau. Niño. Vamos, abuelito. Vamos, abuelito. Vamos, abuelito. Vamos, abuelito. Vamos, abuelito